Hello creative people and welcome back to my channel. For today's video I got inspired by Camilla's holiday dress that she wore last year for Christmas I think, I'm not sure. <laughs> I love this dress, it's such a beautiful dress, beautiful design but I think I would do different changes because I feel much more comfortable with less opening at the front. I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial and let's get started. To create this pattern you will need basic pattern for bodice and the skirt, you can find it on my channel. Once I have the basic pattern, the first step I'm going to do on the front piece is that I'm going to close the incision on the shoulder. That means I'm going to open the incision on the side and I decided to take away the incision that is on the waistline. Then I'm going to add 18 centimeters and connecting that with the neckline. Moving on to the back piece, for the back I'm just going to take away the incision that is on the shoulder. Moving on to the skirt, for the skirt I'm starting with the back piece and I'm taking away 3 centimeters on the lower line. For the front I'm doing exactly the same measurements as the waist and the hips and adding 5 centimeters then connecting it with the lower line. You have to do two of those uh, horizontal towards another. For the sleeves I am going to just add 6 more centimeters just to have them longer than the usual basic pattern for the sleeve. I almost forgot the ribbon. For the ribbon I just cut 1 meter of um, like a rectangle shape with 30 centimeters of thickness and you will need 2 of them to complete a ribbon. For the material I'm using 2 meters of velvet fabric but I do recommend for you to go 3 instead. Measuring band, matching thread, some pins, of course pen or a crayon, scissors and my pattern. The first step as always is to place the pattern on the fabric, measure 1 cm for the sewing and cut out the pieces. I'm starting with the upper part of the dress, so the back and the front and the first step is to sew the incisions. Then you're going to sew the edges, just fold 1 cm and sew a straight line. Place front and back one above the other and sew the sides and the shoulder. Moving on to the sleeves, just flip them in half and sew the whole sleeve up. Attach the sleeves together with a top. Take your skirt part and you're going to start by sewing the incisions on the back piece. Once you have sewed the incisions, place one side of the skirt which you will sew and then once it's sewed, you're going to flip it and sew the uh, other side by ruching it up. Do exactly the same thing for that other piece that is going to be on the front of the skirt. For this little ribbon I just sewed all around and flipped it inside out and just placed it on the skirt. To be complete honest I would definitely recommend for you to go with much more fabric and much more ribbon because I feel like mine doesn't look exactly like in the picture. Um, so that is one thing that I would definitely correct. And of course for the last step is to attach the top and the bottom piece of the dress. Uh, for the top I decided because I don't want that much V opening for my breast, I decided to create much more ruching and to cover the breast area more than what is in the picture. And this is the finishing product. I really love the dress. I think it's very beautiful. I don't like the ribbon at the front, but the dress overall is very beautiful. I do like the changes that I did because I don't feel comfortable wearing this much opening at the chest. 
but it's your own opinion this is mine and uh, yeah i really hope you find this video helpful and useful and if you did please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel like always if you have any other suggestions or what kind of videos you would like to see on my channel please comment below see you till next time hey Ron.